Hey there, it's Fine With Anybody Sarah Co. and I am here to film my haul. So, it's not bad. I really didn't like go crazy with the shopping. Like it looks worse than it is because I have some grab bags. I have an order from Sweet Quiet Design. I have two mystery kits, a like standalone order, and then a handful of washi to show you. So, let's get started. The first one I'm gonna start with is a new to me shop. So this is Cinderella Paper Co. and I always, see Jessica using her kits, right? So I didn't really like the format of the full kits, but I'm here for the format of these micro kits. And I got, um, I think it was like buy two grab bags, get two free. And so I did that and this was just what I kept. This doesn't include the bukus that I gave to my mom and best friend. So there might be duplicates in here. I wasn't like super great about, um, you know, paying attention. So yeah, they're like, they're oops. So, you know, like this is slightly miscut, but it's not bad. So like, I'm kind of excited. So let me show you what I have. The first one, well, you know what? I don't feel like talking through these. I'm just going to show you the boxes. And I know this says 2020, but like, look how pretty these are. I, it'll be fine. So I'm just going to flip through these real quick and you can see the color palette and then the four full boxes and they're all the exact same format. So here you go. I really like this one because of the lobster. I think this one is so cute. I like this girl is just like living for being outside. Oh, I'm here for it. There's a good chance that Kevin might come home. I don't know his new work schedule and I don't think he does either. So if, if he comes home, I'm just going to have to be like, hey, I'm filming. This one I have the art like in two or three other versions, but I was like, I like it enough to have bought it. So might as well keep it for my baby planner. This one I'm here for. Oh, it's just so pretty. Not her, not so much, but the rest. Oh, I knocked some things out. I love this art. I actually think I'm going to use this one this year. I've been hoarding a kid for ages. I like this one. I really think it's really cute. I, I've seen this art though. My favorite version was from Paper Candy Art and I never picked it up, but I feel like I should after seeing this. Love this one. Love everything about it. There's a little smooshes and books and cuddly reading nook and I'm here for it. I like the colors of this one. So I don't think I'll use this one for like 4th of July, probably not, but I feel like it's pretty anyway, even if, I mean, it definitely screams 4th of July. Oh, I did, I like this one only because this box makes me laugh, and then I wish my office looked like this, but it's much bigger of a wreck. Anything coffee related, I'm here for. This one is like super wizardy vibes. I mean, clearly, it's wizardy. I liked all the colors of this one. Kitty cats. This actually looks like where Kevin and I had our three year anniversary trip in Arkansas. It was like a really cool tree house. So I wanted to keep that. Baking, kitty cats and baking. I don't know what it is about this one. I just really liked it. And I might hop, hippity hop over and pick up the full kit. Cause like, I just, I like it. I, I don't know why it's not my usual stack, but I like it. More coffee. I love the colors of this one. It's so good. Food. We know how I feel about food. And then this one, I really like these jammy boxes. Not so much on the girl, but I like the jammy boxes. So that was everything from Cricut Paper. I mean, not Cricut Paper Co. Wow, Cinderella Paper Co. And you can see it's printed on all sorts of different papers. Like, I'm here for grab bag because you get to try all sorts of papers and all sorts of... I'm just... It's, it was a good deal. Yeah, so it was buy two, get three free, or buy three, get two free. It was something ridiculous. And I, I'm really tickled pink by it. So the next shop is Sweet Kawaii Design. And I'll show you what I have. This is actually the, I'll, like you could buy it in, uh, oh, okay, I can, I can get this together. The May kit. So the monthly subscription can actually come to the shop and you can buy it in a la carte. Not pieces, parts, like pages, but you can buy just the weekly kit, just the monthly kit, just the wacky holidays, that kind of thing. So all right, I, I sorted myself. All right, so let me show you what I have. I have the all order freebie. I really think this is cute. Then I got the raincoats critters, like so cute. I like the colors she chose. They're very soft. And I got Sierra's freebie because she always has Frank. And you guys know, I just love Frank. 
Then I have the flea med sticker, which I'm going to be using to remind myself to do the Molly flea meds. She used to get the shot, so I never had to actually put meds on her. And I had to do it for the first time last month and it left a little bald spot, which it cracked me up because I have alopecia and I look like, kind of like Friar Tuck, kind of that look, like nothing on top, but, but like a very luscious ring around by the ears, right? And so I was cracking up with my husband. I was like, I bet you didn't think the two things you love the most are gonna, you know, bald. And he's like, I, I didn't know it, but apparently I have a thing. So yeah, Molly's got a bald spot on the back of her neck and you know, I have my issues. So I thought it was funny. And then this is the sleepy reading stickers. I took this one, I used it already. I couldn't wait. And then this is the May Vertical Kit, it's Gnomes. So I feel like you can kind of get it. I've been hoarding the Gnomes Kit from last year and I'm gonna keep hoarding it and I'm gonna hoard this one too. But I just, it's so cute. I like the colors. I haven't really been feeling the subscriptions that are the Kawaii subscription, but this one got me. I was like, okay. I don't love double boxes as part of my reason I've kind of like stepped back from ordering as much. They're just not my jam. I don't, I don't know why. I don't really like them. Mm. But I mean, this one's really cute. And then like side profile critters, my jam. Then here's the color palette and some this week's stickers. Really cute. Oh, more, bo oh, more boxes. Oh my gosh, he's being a little creeper. Look at Frank, he's being such a creeper. Oh, I'm obsessed with that one. I didn't even see that one. I love it. Checklist. Uh, these are my preferred checklists. I love her fancy, like hand-drawn, fancy, special checklist, but I really like the spacing of these. Love the boxes. And this sheet tends to kind of like change up and I'm here for like this, not jumbo deco, but like a medium deco. Like, isn't that cute? Oh, I like it a lot. I need to be better about using these, but I don't ever use them. I end up just putting them on my stash for later. Then you can see some quarter boxes, habit trackers, weekend banners. And then these are such cute date cards. Like how cute with this little flowers. And then we have the bottom washi, which I don't know if I'll use or not. I like it. And I think if I cut it in half, like where you're only gonna see, you know, this much of it I think it'll be it'll be much more fun pulling in some simply gilded I have some like springtime stuff that might work I don't know we'll find out but I'm about this kit I will continue to hoard this for many a moon who's to say it's definitely enough to do two in a big planner and then you have ample to do a baby planner plus if you were really mindful with like these bigger stickers you could definitely make a full month I'm not mindful like that I'm just gonna probably if I'm lucky get two weeks out of it so so cute so happy with that then the next thing I have is the mystery kit for March I want to say um from caress press this one cracked me up okay so I I can't handle surprises in that as soon as somebody's like hey I just got this in a mail do you want to see I'm like yes yes I do in fact want to see this and so when I saw this the first time I wasn't like super jazzed about it I, I just wasn't but when I got it in hand and I could start seeing all the small details about it, y'all, I cracked up. Okay, so I decided to keep this, by the way. So here is the 15 millimeter add-on. I get the mini kit, so it also comes with the mini foil bundle. Okay, so let me just, <laughs> this one cracked me up. Okay, so like this was the first one that I noticed, like, oh gosh, she spilled her coffee. And then you go and look and it's like, oh no, what happened to your keyboard? Did your bird get it? And then you're like, oh no, look, the cord's been chewed through. And then you keep looking over here and this pizza's fallen over and then this heel's broken and I just, it's funny. It's funny. And so this feels like something that I could use for like a hot mess week, something that maybe have like a massive to-do list or like Sunday night, everything starts going crazy. And I know that the next week's going to be nuts. So I, I thought it was funny. <laughs> Love these colors though. Like these are so my colors. She should be laying on the April one. So I hope I should have it. I would think before my next haul, but if not, it'll just wait. Oh, and this one <laughs> with the gas can. So funny. And then you have the girls, which I really like this girl. She just is like, yeah, I'm wearing my glasses and I've got this can of gasoline. I'm going to burn it all down. I don't know. I just thought this was so clever. And so this might not be your vibe, but you have to admit you've not seen anything in the planner community like this. And it's so funny. So yeah, I'm about it. And then the foil is this, um, kind of, it's kind of like the bonfire foil from SPC. That's at least how it kind of appears to me, but I don't have any way to really like show, you know, like the SPC bows are thick so you can really see it, but this is like a really pretty orange foil and I like it, but I don't know if I like it with the kit. Like, 
Okay, I might, I might like, I don't know. We'll see. This one's probably going to take a while for me to decide to use. Like it has to be the perfect week of just everything going wrong for me to use it. So funny. All right, so the next thing I have is from Glam Planner, and I don't buy from her very often, but she had this Ever After inspired kit. I love that movie, and like, okay, I can't, I just, I love that movie. It's so, it's so good, and this kit is so pretty, and I know SPC had done one, and it never released, and I tried so hard to get my hands on it, but this one I just bought paid full price, all is well, and it's beautiful, and I love it. I didn't get the add-on girls because I didn't feel like they like looked quite right but I love all eight of the main boxes so I'm content so pretty so so pretty and then I also got the label sampler add-on I was gonna get the 15 millimeter add-on but I just was like eh, it's fine but I always need more labels plus actually both these patterns are really pretty so one of them with the bow would be so nice but oh I just I needed this one I want to use it for Kevin and I's anniversary one year but I already have an anniversary kit if we do the plan we have in place for our five year and then I have an up kit that I've been trying to use for our anniversary for a while and haven't made it around to it yet so my final shot oh that's a lie let me do the wash here real quick this is from Simply Gilded. So these two are from the new spring release. I, I'll be honest with you. This one is the one that got me. I was like, you got to be kidding. That is beautiful. And so I picked it up. And then I also got this one in the same spring release. So pretty. And then I got this one from my Easter basket, which I got a lot of less than positive feelings toward my Simply Gilded Easter basket. It's pretty, but I feel like she knew that we all bought it for the Easter bow. And so when there was no Easter bow, I was really sad because like the Easter bow is, oh, it's been one of my favorites. So let me show you if you swatched out. My book, I'm running out of space. So like things are out of order. I've already started my new swatch book. So we have this one, this plaid one, and then I got to go and finish out my plaid page. And then, um, this one. Oh, this is this one. I got off the buy sell trade, which apparently is a go wild roll. I didn't know that. I just thought it was pretty. So that is that one. And then I have a page two of all the florals and you can see that one nice and rolled out. And I don't think I got around to doing the juniper one yet. Let's see. I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Would you guys like to swatch this with me in this book? even though very soon there will be a new book. I thought about doing a swatch with me video, but like I've got like a thousand rolls of washi and I feel like that would be a disaster. <clears throat> oh, sorry, I got a tickle in my throat. So cute, I'm very pleased. So yeah, that is my Simply Gilded order. I just ordered from, it was today, she released out like a rainbow or something and it's very, very pretty and I'm about it. Yeah, she's she's almost full. And these aren't even all my five millimeters. I had to stop because I ran out of space. So the struggle. All right. So next up is my SPC. So first up, I'm going to show you the kit that I bought just because I thought it was gorgeous. It's this one. It is called Hyacinth and I, I love it. I just, I love it. It's absolutely gorgeous. The colors. So this is not like my vibe in real life. Like this is too busy. I need a nap after looking at this, but it's beautiful. And I like the more I looked at it, the more I was like, well, I, clearly I need this. And so here are the add-on boxes, which I think these were freebies, which I don't know. I feel like I like the ones that are in the main boxes, but who's to say? We have the color palette deco. I don't like feats and I don't like hands. So no feetsies and no handsies. I can't. I mean, like I can say that these shoes are incredible and I love the nails, but mm -mm, mm -mm, I don't need random body parts in my planner. This, oh, this page, her patterns, like I feel like they just keep getting better and better. And then here's the bottom washi and this pretty bed and date covers. I don't like it and I want to use it and I almost used it. Um, what week was that? Mm. I think I was going to put it in in May, but I couldn't make space with it for my sister's wedding. Something like that. We'll see, but I think it's, oh, oh, it's beautiful. So pretty. And then finally, we have the SPC um, April 2022 mystery. Okay, so 
when I first saw this, I sent the link, the SPC YouTube video. She always puts up the um, reveal, and I think that's like chef's kiss. I'm so happy she does that. And I was like, Sarah, do I like this? And she's like, girl, yes, you like this. And so I wasn't sure until I got it in my hand, and she's right, I do like it. I think what threw me off was the fact that like, why would a mermaid be carrying a purse? Like, I get, you can understand her, like, shell jewelry and all that kind of stuff. But, like, realistically, madam, where are you going with this leather tote bag? It didn't really make sense to me. So, I think if I leave this one out, I think all of these are beautiful. So, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go with it. So, here are the full boxes. Ooh, dolphin. Oh, that's cute. I didn't even notice. He looks like he's sleeping, but he's just like, ah, the ocean. The deco, her deco is always so nice. The colors are beautiful. I get the ultimate because I want the foil. Ooh, the pattern. This one is so pretty. I think she even mentioned in her video how much she liked that one. Ooh, okay, so let's see which extra boxes we got. We got, oh, a different colorway of her. I like her better. I think her hair is like really pops against her skin tone. Ooh, okay. Oh, there we got a hand. No, no, I don't want random hands, but I like the ice cream, it's very well done. So I think I'll stick to the main boxes here and maybe use the dolphin. Yes, I think I'll use the dolphin to replace the weird like purse situation because I still maintain like, what is a mermaid supposed to do with a purse? It's leather, it clearly is not gonna survive the ocean. And then the foil that came with this, which, so, I like this foil coloring. I'm not sure on the pattern, but I definitely get why she picked the pattern. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use these together, but I like the idea of it. It's this really pretty, oh, it's got a fancy name. I don't know, it's like a lavender hollow. I don't know. But like, it's really, really pretty. But I just feel like this is more tropical leaves, which would make sense because the tropics and, you know, oceans and stuff makes sense. But I feel like this would be more something that I would like hit up Sadie stickers and find some like really cool, she's, Oh my gosh, the word I can't say. Seashell. Seashell stickers. But I also need this, like, because I'm sure there's going to be a beach kit that I'm going to need this. So, like, I'm here for this foil bundle. I also need this in gold. So, like, anybody watching this video and they have this bundle in gold, just straight gold, and they don't want it, you know, just find me on Instagram because I need it. I've got it in, like, a, a shiny gold and a silver and a rose gold, but the regular gold was sold out and I was distraught. So pretty. I really like this. I'm not sure about these hibiscus. Like in my head, they're cute, but I'm not sure. They're not my favorite flower. So yeah, I like this one a lot now that I see it in person and I can comfortably omit the purse. I even don't mind the makeup because you know, mermaid's got to be beautiful. I mean, look at that eye makeup. It's on point. So yeah, that was, that's all I have. Wait, that's not bad. I'm pretty proud of myself. And like, honestly, the only things that I currently have coming in the mail that I know of is my SPCD stash, don't judge me. I only subscribed in the last three months, four months, something like that. And I have some that I need. So I'm hoping that I get some of the ones I was wanting in that D stash. And then I think I ordered from the Crafty Banana. I did, I got the Downton Abbey kit that I've been thinking about for a while because Downton Abbey 2 is coming out um, and I needed it. So I'm never good about seeing movies when they come out. Like the reason I didn't use the wizarding kit is we didn't go see <laughs> that particular movie yet. So hopefully eventually. So anyway, thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you liked my little, my little mini haul. She's, she's not very big, but she's mighty. So thank you so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.